The ninth reason why I love the Philippines is the hospital here. Yeah. And one more thing why, apart from that Hi lovelies, welcome back again to another video. In today's video, we have special guests in our channel. By this time, you guys should be familiar with this face, this Dr. Ravi channel. It's not the first time she's appearing on this channel. By now, you guys should be familiar with her face. And today, she has accepted to grace our channel one more time to tell us what? What do you have for us? Why I love the Philippines. She wants to share with us today why she loves the Philippines. But meanwhile, if it is your first time of seeing our faces, my name is Ruth. And my name is Sherina. Your name is Dr. Sherina. <laughs> okay, Say guys. it aloud. I am Nurse Ruth <laughs> and she is Dr. Sherina. Yeah, guys, my name is Dr. Sherina. And I am also a student nurse. So if it's your first time here, you are highly welcome to Nurse Ruth Nook. Yes. Yay. And for our old G's. Thank you so much, guys, for always clicking in. For those who are still contemplating on subscribing, please hit the red subscribe button. It is free of charge. And remember to turn on your post notification bell so you'll be notified anytime we upload a new video. Without wasting much of your time, guys, let's just dive right into the video. Are you ready? Yes, guys. So much ready. So lovely today, Dr. Sherina wants to share with us some reasons why she loved the Philippines. So, over to you, Doc. All right. How many points do you want to give us, or how many reasons do you have for us? Uh, nine. Okay, nine nine reasons yeah, why nine. you love the Philippines. So, guys, today I will be sharing with you nine reasons why I love the Philippines. Right. So. Um, permit me because I jotted down, I have to jot my points down because I really do not want to leave anything out. So just bear with me if you see me moving my head downwards, don't try to understand, okay, guys. So, guys, the reason why I love the Philippines, or one of the reasons why I love the Philippines, is the education system. Yeah, trust me, guys. Philippines education is very standard and not just a standard it is well organized you know things have been coordinated well here in the Philippines everything goes through a process so guys my uh, moving on to the second reason why I love the Philippines um, it's about the people as well the people of the Philippines are very friendly and accommodating trust yeah. me guys i'm not just making up stories you know you don't need to know anybody for for people to you know approach you um listen to you when you have you know needs or complaints you know they really do not have to know you that much for them to give you a helping hand and so, to be friendly with you yeah and they are friendly yeah. with you know, even, as foreigner, yeah. even as a foreigner even as a foreigner they foreigner, rapport well they rapport with you. Um, yeah that's true not even minding whether you are rich or poor, you yeah. know, a foreigner or no foreigner. They're just these friendly people. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So that's your second reason why yeah, you love the Philippines. Yeah, that's the third reason why I love the Philippines. Mm. <laughs> then moving, moving on, on to my third reason, guys. It is the constant power supply here. Mm. <laughs> Man, guys, you know... If you are coming from the parts of our own exactly. world... Exactly. <laughs> If you are coming from part of our own world, mm -hmm. when you get to the Philippines, because like for me, when I was coming, I heard that it's a developing country. Yes, that's true. And I was expecting to be hearing up Nepa, up Nepa when like, I get to the Philippines, seriously. meaning the, the electricity supply will be on and off, on and off. Yeah, but in the Philippines, true. no, it's not like that, even as a developing country. Please continue with your yeah. points. So, so guys, that is that. Mm. My next reason, why I love the Philippines is the security, right? The That's a very good point. Security. Yeah. The security here, yeah, guys, is mad though. <laughs> <laughs> like 
the security time, is time like, compared yeah. to where compared we are coming, where from, coming that's from. You true. know that, and as mm. uh, as a citizen, nobody wants to live in a place whereby they are scared to go out from their house yeah. or their homes. You know, the yeah. truth, guys. Here in the Philippines, if you want to even go out in the night, you yeah, know, like one a.m. Mm. and two a.m., you can still go out and nothing. Will happen to you. You will not be scared of Nobody anything. Nobody will be scared of anything like um, a robber attacking you. Like or why traveling, like we used to hear back from where we are coming from. Yes. Why traveling? They will stop the people, the travelers, and mm -hmm. everybody to the forest. For real, what she's saying, her points, like the security mm -hmm. Philippines, as a student, even for everybody, they are really trying. Yeah. Okay, guys. So, so guys, moving on to the next reason. Yeah. Number four. So, the beautiful places to visit here in the Philippines. Mm -hmm. There are lots of beautiful mm -hmm. islands here in the Philippines to visit. Like for example, when you are on vacation, you can, yeah. you know, go around places, mm -hmm. see places. And safe places, mm -hmm. it is yeah, safe. Yeah, safe places yeah. guys. So lots of fun and all that. Moving on to my next reason why I love the Philippines mm -hmm. is that Filipinos are very supportive, you know. Guys, trust me, I, uh, this is not hearsay. They are mm. really supportive, you know. And my dear doctora, mm -hmm. I can verge for that. They are really supportive. Even yeah. on this, my channel, for real, Filipinos are supportive. They are supportive. Would you believe that most of my subscribers are Filipinos? Mm. More than half of them, if I'm not mistaken, are Filipinos. I also have them. Um, other people even from my country and other countries but most of my subscribers are filipinos and once they want to support you they give you their full support and apart from channel mm. they also support you like outside generally, generally like, guys you supportive. just need to have the idea mm. just come with the idea yeah. and tell them that guys and um, tell them that this is what i want to do and they'll give you their 100 percent support you're not even expecting anything from you yes. you don't need to give them money or you show any appreciation yeah you just need to just tell them your plans and what you um, you are expecting from them or what you need them to help you whether you're a foreigner or not guys that's true filipinos are really supportive that's okay. true so that brings me to my next point which is um the lifestyle here in the philippines is mm. very simple you know filipinos they, they their lifestyle is so simple in they, they, they don't care about mm. you know very what you have life. they are very simple they don't mind you know just in only just where they simple, live just simple, simple free life free oh lifestyle you know that's so interesting about mm. them that's true that's yeah, a nice so, point so that brings me to my next um point that's so that's your eight, eight, that's eight right that's, yeah, it's already guys number eight reason why i love the philippines is that sorry guys sorry sorry doctor if you mm -hmm. see us looking left and right it's because we are just in the compound just an open place yeah. so that's why there is distraction here and here okay. continue here now okay the so, eighth reason yeah sorry the eighth reason so the eighth reason why i love the yeah. philippines is that uh you know this uh, philippine is a place whereby you can live within your budget oh, yeah. you can live you can just live within your budget and also do you know that if you want to buy something like even though it's in the mall mm -hmm. you want to get something you may have that same thing very expensive and you have moderate you can get things according to like your pocket what you need what you want like the way your money yes, can carry exactly. you you can mm -hmm. get it you can live and also live comfortably exactly. according to like she said according to your, your budget, budget your pocket too <laughs> 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 and that's, um that's i think this is the ninth reason right yeah the ninth reason why okay, i love yeah. the philippines and just to tell you guys i think while i was going through um, this i quickly remembered another point so i'm going to make it the tenth reason mm, thank you so, so lovely as you can see we just changed the background because before we were filming from downstairs that's um, the open compound but because the weather was getting too dark the life of vloggers into that we have to move to the room so now we are completing the video right in the room yes, yes. you continue with your point thank god you jotted them down so just continue so the ninth point guys of the ninth reason why i love the philippines the hospital yeah the hospital yeah 
apart from the fact that it is organized, yeah. it is well equipped. Mm, that's true. See, guys, you want to go to a hospital that is well equipped, and judging from the fact that Philippines is just a developing country, you mm. know, it's so interesting how things are being done here. Mm. And um, the doctors and nurses, they they they, 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 are, they are so respectful to their patients. Ah. Like they respect their patients a That's lot. True. You know, they are well mannered and groomed, you know. They, mm -hmm. they, 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 they have respect for their patients. And, um, you know, as a patient, if you walk down to the hospital and you, maybe you give them your shift complaint. Let's say your shift complaint is um, you're having um, pain on your in your breast, sorry. Okay. So maybe as a lady, a female, you have pain in your breast and you are talking to this nurse about your shift complaint. They automatically will sign you or assign you to a female doctor without yeah, you telling true. them. Mm -hmm. That's true. Mm -hmm. Like for a female, maybe you want to see OB guy in concern, you know, once you hear OB, mm -hmm. you know it has to do with female parts and pregnancy yeah. and all that you know <laughs> exactly. so you want to you know as a female for you to be free with your doctor if you are assigned to a female doctor you'll be free with the doctor yeah. and if there is maybe examination you know now yeah maybe they, will be not, internet yes, they, they can now you'll be free with your doctor you'll be free yes That's guys true. to communicate with your to tell them your complaint and um, you are more relaxed and the environment is suiting for mm -hmm. you but if you are Maybe like what happened to me while I was in my country, you know. Why you were back home? Well, yeah, while I was back okay. home, and um, I had to see the um, female gynecologist, but I requested for it, guys. I I have to because after laying my chief complaint, yeah. the next thing they mm -hmm. did was to give me a male mm -hmm. a male doctor doctor. So I was like, no, I want to see a female doctor. That's back home. Yeah, back home. Oh. You know, then I was much younger growing yeah. up i think i just i just finished my um senior secondary school Your high school my high okay. school yeah mm -hmm. so you know you know how it is with us then girls growing up you yeah. are so you're shy, so shy. Yeah, like, yeah, that's you true. don't want anybody to you know so yeah. that's what happened to me and my dear they they were just like mm -hmm. this is the doctor that is here to attend Available. to you mm -hmm. whether true. you like Available. it or not <laughs> they, yeah. didn't, they didn't they were so rude yeah they were really rude to me they were like um and that is a private mm -hmm. hospital guys Talk you can imagine when it's, you know a government, government hospital Hi, they yeah. were so rude to me like um look listen here listen up young lady this is the doctor that has in fire for falls whether you like it or not Are you serious mm -hmm. Yeah, that but was, that's how it's done back home. Yeah, that's yeah, that was what happened. So coming here and seeing how so finally done which doctor? I was Sorry, like, wow. finally which doctor attended to you back home? It's still a male doctor. Mm. Even upon requesting that they should give me a, 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 female, a female doctor, doctor. they still. You know, gave me a male doctor. Yeah. A doctor, sorry. And you know back home you don't have option. Yeah. Any doctor that is on duty that day is the one you see, whether yes. it's female or that is why we are appealing to Nigerian government mm -hmm. to equip our hospitals. Mm -hmm. All these ones now I'm here studying nursing, you are studying medicine. And after our study, I'm not sure if we are going back home. <laughs> a lot of people will finish school from outside nigeria to go back home will be a problem because the government they are not giving us hope they are not giving us any vibe like to come back home and they are lacking doctors and nurses because if they had enough doctors the way we have it in philippines in philippines they have doctors and nurses that i think that's also the reason why if you are a female you want to see you are you have them stand by you will see them if it's a male you have them but nigeria i don't think they have much mm -hmm. because even the ones they have if everybody have opportunities all of us will leave <laughs> all of us will leave eh? so that's why maybe you don't even have option you have to see the one you should be happy that it, there is a, even one on duty that day so guys that is Majorly the reasons why I love the Philippine yeah. um, hospital, you know, how standard yes, the hospital here is. Moving on to the last point that I said I was going to, I promised you guys I was going to give you. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. That's the 10th point that now. Ten, instead of 9. So instead of 9, yes. she's completing <laughs> 10 points. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. So that's a, um, about the uh, road here. Oh, that the Philippines mm -hmm. government is trying in terms of the road maintenance and all that. Like literally, all the streets here in the Philippines are tied. Mm -hmm. You cannot go to any street and find it on tile, unlike where we are coming from. Please <laughs> <laughs> don't go there so that nobody will come so, for you guys, in the comment section. It's just like, you know. It's encouraging to see that yeah. Philippines, that, is, um, that happens to be a developing country, can still organize things like this yeah. and make things work for their citizens and for their country. Oh my God. You know, so those are the reasons why I love the Philippines. I know there are lots of reasons, but I think these are the ones I can remember. The concrete ones. <laughs> yes. Yes. Yeah. So, guys, that is that for this. Love. And that reminds me about the hospital she talked about. I made a video before about my personal observation about the Philippines hospital. I will leave the link to that video somewhere up here. Please do well to watch it. In that video, I explained like my observations about okay. the Philippines hospital. So we are done with this video. Yes, Thank you are. so much, Dr. Sharina. Thank you so much You're for welcome. gracing. <laughs> our channel Aww. with your presence <laughs> guys, so guys, so guys please make sure you like share this video oh my god watch this video comment okay <laughs> and you know to, to encourage me because for me to come here and do this we need to get her back to this channel yes, how guys. many likes do you want this video to get to? I, I give this likes above one thousand oh my god one thousand please guys i beg you <laughs> So that she will come back to this channel yes. before she leaves finally for Cebu because yes. she's a city girl. Mm -hmm. So do well to comment yes, because Sharina will be going through the comments, your comments. So feel free to drop your comments down in the comment section. Like this, like video, this video to promote this Share channel. This Share this video. Yes, girl. Oh, okay, you just end the vlog. Yeah, road. we love you guys and keep... <laughs> Keep, keep watching okay we we'll, we'll just keep keeping you posted yes and trust me okay whatever you want us to come up with video content and all that just you know put it, in the, it down in the comment section, section. and we are going to you know do our best yeah thank you so thank much you so much love you guys together we just tell yeah, them much love from us to you guys all right okay. together we say bye, bye.